Welcome back to my Christmas special, everybody. In which we're going to get underway with our second game, and it's going to be card sharks on the dock. Let's see how it goes. All right, move that over to the that way, and let's get to it. We just finished playing a Family Feud on the DOS and won $130. Yeah, I'll be him. And who am I taking on today? Let's find out. My opponent for this game is... Matthew, all right. First question goes to me. We have 100 women MDs, general practitioners. Have you ever had to sue a patient in order to get your fee? Um, I'll say 31. How about uh, Matthew, higher or lower? I go higher, and the actual number is only 20. So it was lower. So I get the first crack of the cards. 10. Yeah, I'll change it. Eight, not much better. Higher. It was lower. Matthew, you have to play your eight. You did not win the, the challenge. Lower. It was an ace. All right. We asked 100 single women, if you fell in love with a married man, would you be willing to have an affair with him? Seventy-nine. I'm gonna go lower than that. See the answer. 41. Okay, so it was definitely lower. I want to change that 8. 9. Lower. Mm, man. Okay, Matthew, you have to play your 8. There's another 8. My question. We have 100 California parole officers. From your experience, does capital punishment deter criminals? Uh, say 56. Higher or lower, Matthew? Lower. Let's see the answer. 72. It is higher. Do I want to change that 9? Uh, yeah. Jack. Better card. Lower. Oh, man. No luck. Matthew has to play his 8. It was a 10. Sudden death round. Somebody has to win on this to play the cards. Here we go. Matthew, we have 100 married men. If your daughter were dating a boy who acted just like you two at his age, would you trust him with your daughter? Sixty-five. I'm gonna go lower. See the answer. Fifty-four. It was lower, so I got it. Do I want to keep control of the cards? Good luck, Matthew. Let's turn over all four, and I win the first match on a hundred dollars. Now this is my question for round two. We asked 100 single women. Have you ever sent flowers to a man you were dating? I'm going to go directly up the middle. Say 50. Let's see the answer. 13 of them. Okay. So my base card is an ace. I don't want to change that. Lower. Seven. Freeze. Matthew's question. We asked 100 men at the beach. Have you ever been to a nude beach? How many said they have? 59. I'll go lower. See the answer. 69. It was higher. Matthew has to play off his three. Or Matthew gets the option to change his three, but he didn't want to change it. Higher. Queen. Lower. Three. Higher. 10, lower, and we have a tie game. So now on to round three. We have 100 New Yorkers. Has your apartment ever been burglarized? I will say 57. Lower. Let's see the answer. Only 20. All right. 
So Matthew gets the first crack of the cards. Crack of the cards, he has an ace. I don't think he'd want to change that. Lower. Ten. Lower. There's another ten. I have to play off by five. I'm going to go higher. Ace. Lower. Three. Higher. King. Lower. Oh, so close. Matthew has 100 nurses. Who are more demanding, men patients or women patients? How many said they think that men patients are more demanding? Three? I'll go higher. See the answer. Twelve, just slightly higher. All right. Don't want to change that five? No, I'll keep it. Higher. King, lower. Four, higher. Seven, freeze. Putting me one card away. My question. We asked 106 grade boys, have you ever dumped medicine down the toilet and then told your mom you'd taken it? <laughs> I'm going to say 38. What do you think, Matthew? Higher or lower? Let's see the answer. Oh, it's higher. 61. All right. Matthew has that ace. I don't think he's going to change it. He's going to go lower. Jack, lower. Nine. Freeze. Putting him two cards away. Now we're at sudden death. So this could go either way. And this is Matthew's question. We asked 100 marriage counselors. Would there be fewer divorces if all couples were required to live together before they got married? Sixty. I'm gonna go lower. It's forty. Okay. Do I want to keep control? I'm gonna try this. Yes. I will change the seven. Higher. Yes. Going to the money cards. So we start off with two hundred dollars, and I have a base card of a five. Do I want to change that? That's a negative. I'm gonna bet the whole two hundred dollars that it's higher the three. So we'll move the three up and I get four hundred dollars. Do I want to change that three? No chance. I'm going to bet the whole four hundred dollars that it's higher. Six. Okay, so eight hundred dollars. Okay, I'm not going to change the six. I'll play it. And I'll go half of it, four hundred dollars, that it's higher. Four. Alright, so I'm down to four hundred dollars. I'll bet the full, whole four hundred dollars. I don't want to change it. That it's higher. The jack. Okay, so I have $800. Don't want to change that jack? No. I have to bet at least $400. I'm going to bet $700 that it's lower. Today, an so I have $1,500 in the money cards plus $200 in the game. $1,700 I walk away with. Not bad. And I'll see you all for the next game after this break. Well, 